Hello guys, welcome to Amtin Dreams. We are off to the land of kingdoms. Still guessing the place? Okay, let me tell you. We are going to Rajasthan. Now, we are on our way to Kempe Gowda International Airport. We have planned 8 days trip to Rajasthan. It's our first flight together, so we are very excited. Our check-in was at 1:30. Since we reached early, we are planning to explore the launch. Is anyone aware that we can have a buffet at just rupees two in the airport? Hello guys, we are going to check into the launch. We have used our access card and Canara Bank accounts, and so we got the access. So we are going to check out how the launch will be. Most of the airports have this facility. All you need to do is just pay two rupees and get unlimited Wi-Fi, food, mocktails, and drinks. We tried fresh juices, mocktails, and buffet lunch. At the launch, you can enjoy both veg and non-veg buffet with some yummy desserts as well. If you are also planning for a trip, then here comes our tip number one. If you are planning to travel by flight, you need to book at least one month ahead, else it will cost you more. You can check in the flight websites or Skyscanner app, Hopper apps for discounts. Now we are in the bus that shuttles us to the flight. Here we are all set to fly to Rajasthan. So let's fly. We are going to cover Jaipur, Udaipur and Jodhpur in these 8 days. 3 days we will spend in Jaipur, 2 days in Udaipur, 1 day for Kumbhalgarh Fort and Ranakpur Jain Temple and 2 days for Jodhpur. Due to extreme temperatures, we won't be able to travel to Jaisalmer as the temperature is around 48 to 50 degrees there. Adrenaline rush came in just as we took off from the runway. We feel we are in the heavens amidst the clouds. Wow, the view is breathtaking. We are planning to visit Rajasthan for eight days, so we will give you tips for budget-friendly stays, sightseeing, food exploration, and exploring Rajasthan to the fullest. We will be covering Jaipur. Udaipur and Jodhpur will show you the stays at Havelis budget friendly homestays and also show you how people in Rajasthan get used to the hottest climate with their food habits as well After 2.5 hours of flying we have finally landed in Jaipur Oh my god the temperature is 41 degree here Despite being a desert land, Rajasthan is home to mighty forts such as Mehranga Fort in Jodhpur, Amer Fort in Jaipur, Chitorgarh Fort, 
Kumbalgarh Fort and also gorgeous palaces like Umed Bhavan Palace in Jodhpur and Jal Mahal in Jaipur. So here comes our luggage. After collecting our luggage, we are out of this small and beautiful airport at Jaipur. It's 6:20 p.m. But see, we can still see the sun here. It's still daylight. It's actually a surprise to the people who are from South India. We hope we will see at least one shower before we say goodbye to Rajasthan.